the birth of bitcoin the genesis of block bitcoin's origin trace back to an online cryptography forum where the concept of bitcoin was introduced on october 31st 2008 by the pseudonym satoshi nakamoto nakamoto's message outlined a new peer to peer electronic cash system designed to eliminate the need for trusted intermediaries like banks a white paper nakamoto's paper bitcoin a peer to peer electronic cash system outlined the core principle of bitcoin that is peer to peer network bitcoin operates on a decentralized network of computers removing the need for trusted third parties to facilitate transactions next one blockchain technology the blockchain a public ledger of transactions is crucial for preventing double spending and maintaining a transparent record next one mining users or miners validate transactions and create new bitcoins by solving complex puzzles this process ensures the security and stability of the network nakamoto's vision nakamoto's vision was not just about creating a new currency but about challenging the existing financial system first one a uh, critic of banks nakamoto criticized traditional banks for their roles as middlemen slow transactions and adding costs next one is ideals of cyberpunk culture bitcoin was influenced by cyberpunk ideals embracing privacy and personal freedom nakamoto envisioned bitcoin was a new way to reclaim financial privacy and reduce dependency on centralized institutions historical context bitcoin's development occurred against the backdrop of 2007-2008 financial crisis financial collapse the crisis revealed significant flaws in the financial system including risk lending practices and inadequate regulatory oversight okay public discount this is there uh, there was a widespread dissatisfaction the government bailouts and perceived irresponsibility of financial institutions bitcoin's philosophical foundations Bitcoin aimed to address several issues highlighted by the financial crisis. First one is trustlessness. By removing the need for intermediaries, Bitcoin eliminates the potential for manipulation and fraud. Second, decentralization. The networks relies on the distributed system of users rather than a central authority aims to prevent the concentration of power and reduce systemic risk bitcoin software release on january 8 2009 nakamoto released the first version of a bitcoin software making the official launch of bitcoin network this release significant mean the beginning of a new era in digital currency free from the constraints of traditional financial systems what is the main conclusion means bitcoin's birth was a response to the failings of the traditional finance system driven by a vision of a more decentralized transparent and secure from the money it's a representative fundamental shift into the conceive and manage currency challenge long term standing financial practices and offering a new model for the future